वंदे गुरुपद्वंद भक्त बिंद समीचैतन्य प्रभु वंदे निंद सहोदित श्रीनंदनंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन सुक्त बिंदन मनोहर वाचा कल्पतरुश के पास सिंधु पवित पति पावने वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुकोतिचाल पंगुंगलंघयत गिर यत्तम वंदे परमाधव बृंदा हो तुलसीदेव्या वै केशवशक्ति वे देवी सत्वत्व नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नरोंच नरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जो मुदीर संकीर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीय पत्रश प्रकाशने सदानुरक्त गुरु भक्ति युक्त भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोद्वरण धैय सदा परिभवनमीष्टदूहम तीर्थास्पद शिव विरंजनुत शरण्यम भीताहम पुनपाल भवादीपूत वंदे महापुरुष ते चरण यदपल्लवन चंदमि छटा जत्पादपल्लोत किमी पूर्णागर सुसागर सारूर्ति शाराधि श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु निनंद सियादराधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु निनंद शिवाद्वैत गाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनका बुदा तो संकर्तन कवितरु कमलायताक्ष विशाबरु द्विजरु जुगधर्म पालो वंदे जगत प्रिय करु करुणा हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे नमा गंगे तव पादुपंकज सुरासुरवंदी तो दिव्य रूप भुक्ति मुक्ति चीनीत भावान्ण सदा नर नरान गंगा तरंगरमणीयटाकलापम गौरी निरंतर विभूषि तो वाम भाग नारायण प्रियमनंग मदापहारम भरानसीपुरपति भज विशनाथ वागीशुष वदने लक्ष्मीज च भक्षसी यस्ते हृदय संबीतिशिंगमहम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे 
ಮಾಧುರ್ಯತೆನಕ್ತ್ಯಾಬೇನ ಚಾವಜ ದಿವಾಚಾರ್ಥಿಹಯ ರಾಜನ್ ಕುಟುಂಬಭರಣೇನ ನಿದ್ರಯಾಹಿಯತೆನಕ್ತ್ಯಾಬೇನ ಚಾವಯ ದಿವಾ ದಿವಾಚಾರ್ಥಿಹಯ ರಾಜನ್ ಕುಟುಂಬಭರಣೇನ ನಿದ್ರಯಾಹಿಯತೆನಕ್ತ್ಯಾಬೇನ ಚಾವಯ ದಿವಾಚ ಅರ್ಥಹಯ ರಾಜನ್ ಕುಟುಂಬಭರಣೇನ ಗೌರಿಯ ಗೋಷ್ಠಿಪತಿ ಶ್ರೀಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಡಾಗ್ ಪಾ ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಟೋಲ್ಡ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಗೋ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಅಟ್ರಾಕ್ಷನ್ ಆರ್ ರಿಪಾಲ್ಷನ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಮೆಟೀರಿಯಲ್ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ಆಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಕೌಂಟ್ಲೆಸ್ ಆಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಅಟ್ರಾಕ್ಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ರಿಪಾಲ್ಷನ್ ಟು ಡು ಹರಿ ಭಜನ್ ಫಾಸ್ಟ್ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಗೋ ಔಟ್ ಅಟ್ರಾಕ್ಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ರಿಪಾಲ್ಷನ್ ಅಟ್ರಾಕ್ಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ರಿಪಾಲ್ಷನ್ so long we can feel attraction and repulsion for any object or any man till then hari bhajan is impossible how we can get absolute mangal prabhat giving answer there is griha brata dharma those who are attached with material things there was too much affinity for material sansar they have some attraction griha brata griha ashakta then they cannot get consciousness not possible those who are going to do krishna seva anukha continuously under the guidance of such a guru who is himself all the time doing seva of krishna busy anugatto in that case no problem can stand <clears throat> if we can if we can sell our head unto the lotus feet of such a exalted guru who is always all the 24 hours busy with krishna seva then no problem can stand in the way of our hari bhajan we must follow pure devotees we must serve them proba speaking because they are bhagavat bhakta bhagavat preshta gurudev and vaishnav they are bhagavat bhakta bhagavat preshta their seva can give us mangal absolute mangal by the mercy of guru pat padma by the mercy of guru vaishnav we can get kripa we can do seva by guru seva we can deliver ourselves at the same time by perfect guru seva we can also take the res- responsibility to deliver other bonded souls guru seva sarva dharma tamattamam guru seva sarva dharma tamattamam ತಸ್ಮತ್ ಪರತನ ಧರ್ಮ ಪವಿತ್ರ ಧರ್ಮ ನವೈದ್ಯತೆ ಸಚ್ ಪ್ಯೋರ್ ಡಿವೋಷನಲ್ ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸ್ ಐ ಮೀನ್ ಭಾಜನ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ಗುರು ಸೇವಾ ಇಸ್ ಶೋ ಪ್ಯೋರ್ ವಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಡೆಲಿವರ್ ಅವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ ಎಟ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಟೈಮ್ ವಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಟೇಕ್ ದ ರೆಸ್ಪಾನ್ಸಿಬಿಲಿಟಿ ಟು ಡೆಲಿವರ್ ಅದರ್ ಬೊಂಡೆ ಸೋಲ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದ ಕೇಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಪ್ರಹ್ಲಾದ್ ಮಹಾರಾಜ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಹಿಯರಿಂಗ್ parid pulad ma speaking prabhu how you can deliver me i already delivered i was serving your your servant i mean naraji maharaj so you are very much interested to show kripa on me but i am already enjoying your kripa through guru vishnu and naraji maharaj guru vishnu of all the 24 hours they have no other duty they are doing krishna seva all the time so if we can serve them help them in their seva is a great benefit we can get so anyway 100% guruvanugatha 
is very important. Without Guru Vanugatta, if we try to do Krishna Seva, well, I have taken initiation from Srila Bhakti Pumatpuri Goshema, that is one kind of false ego. Guru Padma never used to see that way. Guru Padma used to speak, I am not your Guru. You all think I am your Guru, but actually I am not your Guru. Prabhupada is your Guru. Try to serve Prabhupada. Very humble way. So, if we leave Gurudev, if we like to pass away Gurudev and try to preach, I am a great preacher and try to, you know, do, you know, Seva, that is not actually Seva. As per authentic Shastra, nowhere say. And material, you can get some material success. You can get the opinion of mass of people, big people. Big group can run you. That that is not the symptom that you are a great devotee. Even whole world running behind you, still it is not guaranteed that you are enjoying full kipa of Bhagavan. Because Maya Devi always going to play some jugglery. Want to make fool of you. So that you cannot understand who is Sadhu, what is Prachar, Harika, what is Harikatha. You cannot understand. Without Guru Seva, avoiding Gurudev or Sampraday, if I like to show some Seva, it is simply false ego, nothing else. Those who are foolish people, they can understand. But other Tattagyani people cannot approve. They, after hearing even one word, they can immediately catch it is false. Immediately. Yeah. They can understand. Avoiding Gurudev, our Guru Seva, my Guru Seva is one kind of false ego, nothing else. So this kind of, you know, false ego should not be there in, inside my heart. Because this false ego can ultimately make me fall down. Because this false ego ultimately can, you know, lead me up to fall, up to fall down. This much. This much can happen. That is the main reason of fall down, of Guru. You know, if we want to search defects with Guru Vishnu, those who are approved by Prabhupada, Bhakti Siddhanta, Saraswati Goswami, Dagur Prabhupada, as per the opinion of Prabhupada, Prabhupada speaking, those devotees they are serving Gauriya Mart, most of them actually Prabhupada speaking, Prabhupada speaking about those who are genuine devotees, about them Prabhupada speaking, they are selected, recruited, they are selected by the Supreme Lord. Do you think there is another way, any other way rather than Goryamat? Because the, all the members, I mean the, you know, those who are doing, serving Goryamat, they are selected by Bhagavan Himself, Prabhupada speaking, Bhakti Siddhanta Sasa. If we like to find fault, they are useless, they are not preacher, they are this way if you speak all rabbis, they only wanted to collect money, whereas they are pure devotees. We should not speak this way. This way, if we like to find fault with Guru Vaishnava, then there is all big fault time can be there in my life. Prabhupada speaking Sarvanash. Sarvanash Anivarjo, inevitable. Prabhupada speaking, your Sarvanash fall down, inevitable. Don't try to take risks this way. It is my request. Without Guru Shabha, we can never get Mangal. No advantage we can get. If we can become busy with personal interest, personal patishta, I can speak Harikatha, somebody can play hand fan to prove my gravity, to prove my, you know, dignity. This is not dignity. Dignity is Acharan. Dignity is a speech Harikatha, which is coming from heart to change your heart. That is called Jivadaya. You can understand. Follow. So Guru Vaishnava Seva, without Guru Vaishnava Seva, bonded soul can never get any way out. Bonded soul can never get any way out. No way out. Be careful. Big problem can happen. So, Prabhupada speaking, first of all, 
in in this in this world decorated by Maya. Maya they be opening new market, where the supermarket, where all different kind of objects and men and women they are for attraction. If we first of all we'll have to go out of attraction and repulsion, dharma inside our heart. We are feeling. This we should avoid, otherwise not. The sloka I started with is really very important sloka. Night time we are sleeping. Nidraya hriyate naktam bebaye na chavavayo diva arte haya rajan kutumba bharane nava. What is the meaning? Meaning is that nidraya hriyate naktam. Our night, we are going to sleep 10 hours, 12 hours, 8 hours. But devotees, they are allowed only 4 hours resting. Not even that. <laughs> Follow. So, whole night we are going to spend by sleeping. Nidraya hyata naktyam, bhava eno chava bhayo, the relationship between woman and man, we are busy with that enjoyment. Follow. Whole night. Going. And daytime we are busy to collect money, position, everything, whole day and night. We are going to take care of our children, our friends and oh, lady love. Oh, we are busy. Collect money, rank, position, everything. Diva cha arthya haya. Arthmana mani. Sankarajajya speaking. Arthmana artham bhavaya nitvam. But who is going to, who is going to realize? What you think it is meaningful in your life, that is, that is not meaningful. What you think it is very meaningful for you in your life, even as a devotee, so-called devotee, you think it is very important, but it is less important. Not. If I ask somebody that what is your achievement, he can speak, Maharaj, well, I have, I have, you know, triple MS certificate, I have done doctorate, I have a service holder, I am a service holder uh, or pension holder, whatever it may be. And I have some rank and position he can identify. He is not going to think about his spirit, Atma. He don't think all relative relation. All rela relative relation he is going to give attach, you know, going to give importance. He is going to give too much importance to all worldly relation. Relative relation. Actually, my identity is my. I am the servant of my guru. This is my actual identity. Otherwise, I have no identity. What identity can put in front of you? So, whole day night uh, we are going to, you know, run here and there in search of money, 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 sweeter than honey. This way. Kutumba Bharani. Take care of a relative. Lady love, wife, or friend, whatever we are going to waste our time. But in Srimad Bhagavatam, 7th Cantro, we find it is the Siddhanta Vichara Prahlad Maharaj. Bimunchati Jada Kamana Manava Manasa Sthitano Tarihi Eva Pandari Kaksho Bhagavad Taya Kalpati. Follow what I say. Bimunchati. Bimunchati munchati mean munchati mean to live, to avoid. Bimunchati mean to specially you will have to avoid. What? What? Kama no. All different kind of kama inside heart. The moment Ajivatma is successful. To, over, to overcome this kind of impediments like different kind of karma, krodha, everything, then he can get his transcendental position back. He can get back. Bimunchati jada kamana manova manasa sitano. Our whole mind is contaminated with different kind of demands and enjoyment, mood, totally contaminated. Our, our heart, totally mind, everything. Bimunchati yada kamana manova manasa sthitano 
when a man can wipe up, can erase any kind of smell of karma from the heart immediately. Tarhi eva tarhi eva jarhi tarhi is called immediately. Jarhi, the moment, the moment is successful, then and there. What happens? Pundari kaksha, that a man become Bhagavat Tayakalpati, he can get the power inside his heart to overcome all different kind of maya. He can help other Jivatma also this way, this power can get. We can get. Vimunchadi yada kamana manava manasa sthitano tarhi eva pundari kaksha bhagavatta ayakal. He can get bhagavatta. I mean, Bhagavan is transcendental, he can also reach because matter and prakriti, all actually contamination. Jivatma cannot have and does not have any relations with it, matter and maya, but it's a must. What to do? We have fallen into maya and due to maya, I mean Sataraja Damagun, different kind of modes of nature, we feeling ourselves, we are, we are feeling doership, we are man, we are woman, we are enjoyer. This way we are going to put ourselves in big bondage. The way out is Guru Seva, Vaishnav Suddha Vaishnav Seva. Hear Harikatha. Go whole day and night try to hear Harikatha as soon. And when you are busy with other Seva, then you must remember the Siddhanta Vichara of Guru Vaishnav all the time. This way you will have to cover, you know, all the 24 of Harikatha means you have to remember. That is the main question. If we are going to going to get a you know if we are going to live if we are going to live hundred years for hundred years what use if there is no Krishna consciousness if there is no Krishna consciousness at all inside the heart if at all there is no Krishna consciousness inside the heart what use what use living hundred years only nonsense only you know. You know, garbage. What I can do? King Pramatta Shobahuvihi Parakshair Parakshair Hayanair Riho Baram Muhurtam Viditam Gatate Sreyose Yataha Khattanga Raja He wanted to know from demigods. Demigods, they were very happy because Kattangaraja was a big fighter and king. He was helping demigods and the demigods, this party was successful. So demigods wanted to bless him. Benediction. But Kattangaraja asking, before asking benediction, I, I want to know my lifespan. How long I am going to live more? Demigods said, well, you are going to die immediately. Only you know, 24, 24, 48 minutes. Very, very short. Muhurto. Viditva. After knowing, after, uh, after knowing that lifespan is left only a few minutes, immediately, Kattangara says, what use of taking benediction? If life is there, then the question of enjoyment can come. A life is not there, what I can do? Then he was immediately concentrating his mind unto the lotus feet of Supreme Lord and he was successful. So why you cannot successful? So why you cannot come out successful? We all can come out successful if there is rigidity, if there is resolution, if there is seva, if there is determination, we can come out successful. So, in the Sastra, in Bhagavatam, it is 11th Canto, 11th Canto, 28th chapter, number 1, so, King Pramatta Shobahuvi. Now, I like to give you a reminder, because, you know, it is, it is written in Bhagavatam, why why? Because the Bhagavad session, first Bhagavad session, Shukadev Goswami speaking to Parikshit Maharaj, second Bhagavad session in Naimi Sharana, 
Follow. Noemi Saranna, they are actually hearing Harikatha, all Rishi money from Sutadev Goswami. Follow. What is he? And, and Gokarnaji Maharaj speaking Bhagavatam in uh, Tunga Bhadra Nadi at the bank, there in front of Dundukari. In front of Dundukari, he was speaking Harikatha, Bhagavad Katha. So, this way, I am speaking about. This way, I am going to speak about the second session of Bhagavad Katha. When, when, when the, when the second session of Bhagavad Katha was going on, when the second session, when the second session of Bhagavad Katha was going on, then all Rishi Mani follow. They are hearing Harikatha Bhagavad Katha from Sutadev Goswami. Shutadev Goswami is the disciple of Shukadev Goswami. Sanakadi Rishi hearing. They are putting one question which is very relevant here, yeah, very important. What is that question? But uh, actually, why Parikhid Maharaj was powerful? Then why Parikhid Maharaj is going to leave Kali? He could kill Kali. Kali is the source of evil. Why not Parikhid Maharaj is going to kill Kali? He wanted to take out the sword, but still he couldn't kill. What can be the reason? About Parikhid Maharaj, it is written in the comment. The comment written in Bhagavatam, not commentary, comment. <laughs> commentary, not comment, comment. It is written that the Rajan, that the Raja Parikhid Maharaj is a great elevated soul. And about him, three, poor, three, four places, there it is written inside Bhagavatam, Esho Mahabhagavataha is Mahabhagavat. He is not an ordinary man, bonded soul, not that, don't think that way. So, at all Parikhit Maharaj could kill Kali to give us advantage to do bhajan properly. Then why Parikhit Maharaj is going to, you know, leave Kali without killing? About Parikhit Maharaj, it is written, Sharanga Eva Sarabhu. One title given in Bhagavatam about Parikhit Maharaj, it is written that Parikhit Maharaj is Sharanga Eva Sarabhu. Sharanga means? Sharanga, you know? Sharanga means actually honeybees. Honeybees. Honeybees always going to drink honey, honeybees always going to collect honey from flowers and special honeybees those are available in kailas parvat manas sarabhar they are only drinking you know the you know the you know the honey which is available in the core of lotus flower so what to speak about parikhit maharaj it is written that parikhit maharaj is Sharanga Eva Sarabhuk is a very, very competent personality. Very, very wise. Very, very Pandit. Big. Sharanga Eva Sarabhuk. And he was very like, you know, Paramangsa. He always wanted to take the cream, not, not the wastage. Re you know, follow. Residue, not that. He always busy to collect cream of the substance. Follow what is so Sarango Eva Sarabhuk Mini is a very very important personality. Sarango like 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 the honey is always going to collect honey, not the poison available in the flower. You are hearing new. I know. I know you are hearing new. I know you are hearing new because you never heard it. Papa speaking, Papa speaking, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Papa speaking. In the flower, honey is available. In the flower, in the flower, honey is available, we know. And also, in the flower, poison is also available. You know that? You have no information about that. The duty of honeybees is to collect honey and the luta kit, one kind of special creature, insect, when you collect poison. Same place. In the flower, honeybees, they are going to collect honeys from flowers, whereas the luta kid, one kind of special insect, we are going to collect poison. 
दो दो हनी बी दो हनी बी नीड नॉट टेक एनी हेल्प दो दो हनी बी नीड नॉट टेक एनी हेल्प फ्रॉम लूथर किट टू गेट हनी टू कलेक्ट हनी फ्रॉम फ्लावर स्टिल अनयूजल फैक्टर समटाइम द फाइटिंग टू प्लेस टेकिंग प्लेस लूथर किट दो दे द पर्पज दो द पर्पज इज टोटली सेपरेट He is going to collect, you know, that lutek is going to collect poison, whereas honey is going to collect honey. There is no need of fighting, but still, sometimes fighting takes place because honey is feeling some impediments, you know, feeling some way because they are making some, you know, you know, problem. So this way, actually. Parikhit Maharaj was given title in the Bhagavat. Saranga, he was Sarabok, very competent, very intelligent. So he was always busy to collect the cream from any substance. So why Parikhit Maharaj not going to kill Kali? The reason given there, yeah, the reason given there in Bhagavatam that Kali Kal, Kali Kal is a full of evil. Kali Kal is the age of Kali Kal is the age of controversy. Kali Kal is the age of controversy. All the always fighting taking place. Nobody can take the cream. Always fighting and you know false ego everything. Parikit Maharaj took decision. Kali, do Parikit Maharaj award, do Parikit Maharaj award about the fact that Kali. कलेर दोष नीध राजन अस्ति एक महान गुणो कितना देव कृष्ण से मुक्त संग परम भजे देर इज वन एंड सिंगल वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वाइटल क्वालिटी इन दिस कली खान दो कली इज अ सोर्स ऑफ ऑल इवल बट स्टिल देर इज वन यूनिक क्वालिटी देर इन बा ओनली बाय चैंसिंग एंड डांसिंग हरिकथा हरिकीर्तन वन कैन काट बॉन्डेज and go you know successful can go successful so and so it is written in bhagavatam the kaler dosh nid rajan asti ek mahan gunaha kitana dev krishna samukta sang param bhajet so how parikhit mar can kill kali because kali do the source of all evils but parikhit mar watching that kali do is a source of evil still kali has a unique quality that in this kali kal somebody going to chant hari naam kirtan sankirtan can come out successful so the siddhanta written there anyway those are crazy anyway it is written siddhanta anyway those who are crazy those who are not going to concentrate they are mine and to a lot of speed of guru vishnu and bhagwan anyway they are going to be they they are going to be attracted by kali maya anyway those who are having sufficient consciousness they like to develop their consciousness they are very much aware about their personal interest mean bhakti personal interest सावई पुंसम परो धर्मो यतो भक्ति रधक्षाये अहित गया प्रतिहता जयात्मा सुप्रसिद्ध थी। So why परिक्षित महाराज didn't want to kill Kali? There is a reason. So you see here in Bhagavatam we find eleven कैंतो किंग प्रमत्तशो बहुविहि परक्षयिर हायनेरी रिहो। What use? what use living so long time what use what use living so long time on the in this material world better if you are very conscious very very if we can utilize a very short period of time and life a hari bhajan that is more practical king pramatta shodha pramatta crazy they are not paying any attention to hari bhajan For them, any, for them, anyway, problem is waiting, trouble. What we can do? King Pramattasya Bahuvihi Parakshayir Parakshayir Hayani Dio. What use? 
what use living for long period of time in the one is our Baram Muhurtam Viditam Gatate Sreyasi Yataha. If we are going to live for a short period, Prabhupada used Prabhupada gone from this material world within 24 hours, uh, within 64 years. Prabhupada gone. Follow. So how long we are going to live, I don't know. So King Pramatta Shabahubi Parakshair Hayanai Riho Baram Muhurtam Viditam Gatate Sriyasi Yataha. If we are going to get great benefit within the short period of life of our, li of our life in our, in our period, that is very good. <coughs> because from Gita, from Gita, we know very well Bhagavan going to declare in Gita in front of Arjun, Bhagai Sarjo Prasaktyanam Taya Prahita Chetasam Bhavasatmika Buddhi Samadho Na Vidhiyate. Those who are busy with material enjoyment, those who are busy with material enjoyment, very, very at affinity, attachment there, and their mind is totally captivated by this kind of, captivated by this, this kind of enjoyment mood. They have no intellect, fine intellect, to go out of this problem. Many to calculate and, and choose a line by which in their brain can save them. If my intellect cannot save myself, what use? It's got material intellect, Babasat Pika Buddhi, Babasat means settlement. First of all, you have to find a settlement of your life. What you want, what you don't want, what you want, what you don't want, you have to have a settlement in your life. Otherwise, never you can do bhajan. Never. Also, we know four type of four type of so-called devotees they are doing bhajan. Krishna speaking. There is one explanation I already already explained it before, long before my six months before. Chaturvida bhajante man yana sukriteno arjuna arto jigaso artharti gani chavartha. Two categories. Artho when doing Jigasu question, Jnani, you know, Artharthi, those who are only want some benefit, Artharthi, Artho, those who are in trouble, going to die, feeling problem and going to, going to get some, you know, benefit. So, four type of Krishna speaking, Chaturvida Bhajante, Mang Jana, Sukriti, No Arjuna, Artho Jigyasu Artharthi Gyani Chavardhar Sava. Now I can come back to the topics I know Parikit Maharaj, I mean our Pallad Maharaj, our Pallad Maharaj the Great, our Pallad Maharaj the Great, you know, we like to discuss this point. Pallad Maharaj the Great, you know, Pallad Maharaj never wanted to get any benefit from Supreme Lord. Prahlad Maharaj never wanted to get any benefit from Supreme Lord. Rather, Prahlad Maharaj wanted to identify himself as a devotee who is less interested about any interest, taking any interest from Bhagavan. You know, that's why Bhagavan loved him very much. Bhagavan speaking that you are the idealism among my devotees. You are the exclusive idealism among my devotees. So, you know, when Naraji Maharaj going to speak that Bhagavan wanted to give you so many things, you know, benediction and everything, but still you wanted to avoid, you never wanted to claim anything from Bhagavan. And on the contrary, you told Bhagavan, Yet Kamanam Hidhi Sangraho Babadastu Binevaram. Hey Bhagavan, Kamanam Hidhi Sangraho Babadastu Binevaram. Bhagavan, you bless me. So that no desire, no smell, no smell of desire, no smell of desire can appear inside my heart. That kind of benediction I want. And some somebody can start fighting. Then why Prahlad Maharaj going to take up the trouble to sit in the throne of Father? 
Why? Big kingdom, you know, big ray, you know. Why Prahlad Maharaj is going to take trouble to sit in the chair of father who was a, you know, big, you know, king? Follow Hiranagasibu. Why? Then it is written that Prahlad Maharaj never wanted to accept. Prahlad Maharaj never wanted to accept that kingdom. Nothing. Prahlad Maharaj Niskinchan Bhakta. Pallad Maharaj in Niskinchan Bhakta, Pallad Maharaj never wanted to take responsibility personally. He was less interested to take control over the kingdom. Only it was the desire, it was the desire of Nishingadev. You will have to take, I like to keep you as a representative, as an idealism in the material world. Anyway, well, if you are going to sit, in the chair as a king, all your personality, all your, you know, dignity, everybody can know who can say they can change their life after sweat, after watching you. So as a, as a representative, as a, as a representative, Bhagavan wanted to keep Prahlad Maharaj in the material world, Prahlad Maharaj by the request, by the desire of Nishingadev, he was bound to take control over this kingdom. Also, the case of Uddha Maharaj. Uddha Maharaj also, you know, Uddha Maharaj also, there is the case, Uddha Maharaj never wanted to take anything from Bhagavan. Uddha Maharaj is also follow. Still, Bhagavan wanted to keep, Bhagavan wanted to keep Uddha Maharaj as a representative in this material world. Uddha never wanted to stay in this material world. He was crying and crying. He brusted, he brusted into tears in front of Bhagavan. I cannot live without you. You are going to climb, you are going to climb your eternal abode. But please, mam, mam, nayo mam opi. Nayo min, please take me with you. Nayo mam opi. Also you can take me with you. Bhagavan speaking, you love me, na? You love me, na? You serve me, na? So, my desire is your desire. I like to keep you in this material world as a representative, as an idealism of a devotee. So, you will have to act as an acharya. You will have to stay as, a represent, as my representative. So, you cannot go. First of all, you can go to Badrikasram. There also, Pralatma doing bhajan in Badrikasram. Badrika Asram, also Parma Pallad Maharaj, hey, also Uddhav Maharaj staying in Badrika Asram and also in another form Pallad Maharaj always staying in Uddhav, Uddhav Kunda. Uddhav Kunda, near Radha Kunda. They eternally present. There in Chaitanya, in, in, in the glorification of Bhagavatam Skanda Puran, it is written, in the form of creepers and herb, surely, Uddhav Maharaj, they are resting, I mean doing bhajan in Uddhav Kunda. Don't express any doubt about it. Now, Pallad Maharaj is going to, Pallad Maharaj going to express his grief because Gurudev is going to glorify. He don't, he never like to hear glorification from Gurudev. Prabhupada speaking, that the day, the day, the day we become interested to hear glorification from the lotus mouth of Gurudev about ourselves, that day is very bad day. Papa speaking, the day, the day we become interested to hear our personal glorification from the lotus mouth of Gurudev, that is our very dark day, black day. Be careful. Follow. Papa always used to glorify some devotees after they refine, after they refine, they, are, they are fall down. All the Svoboda used to, used to glorify them. Finally, we discover they all fall down. So we never like to hear. This is misfortune. I think, I think it is my misfortune. I think it is my misfortune. If I am going to hear some glorification of myself, from Gurudev. So I never like to hear anything from my Gurudev about my personal glorification. It is very bad. Pallad Maharaj giving argument. Pallad Maharaj giving nice argument. Pallad Maharaj giving nice argument to 
to to to to Naraji Maharaj. It is written that day due to internet problem I want to stop but I couldn't complete that so I like to remind you then after that I can go onward. It is written Prahlad Maharaj going to going to speak that Hanu Madadi Bhattasho Kapi Sheva Kritastina Param Vigna Kule Chitte Smaranam Kriyate Maya Very spectacular thing. This is called devotee. They never claim anything. Gurudev, you are going to glorify me. I think you like to cheat me. Eh? I have never I have never done any seva like Hunuman, Uddhav, Adi, etc. They are serving Bhagavan all the time. But I have no scope to serve. On the contrary, only my heart is always full of anxiety. And with this, with this, in this condition, I am going to think about the Supreme Lord, Smaran. Follow. Smaran Akha Bhakti. Savanam, Kirtanam, Vishnu, Smaranam, Pada, Sevanam. I know, Smaranaka Bhakti is also Bhakti, but out of humble attitude, hum, out of very humble mood, Praladma speaking, uh, uh, you can say that I am doing Smaran, Smaranaka Bhakti, but be, but be sure that my Smaran is not perfect, because my, my heart is always full of anxiety. So, you can speak, I am doing some Smaranaka Bhakti, but my mind and heart is always full of anxiety. So for a long time, it the <coughs> you can remember what Pallad Maharaj speaking. Param bigna kule chitte smaranam kriyate maya. This word, if you have any conception about Sanskrit. You can realize that Pallad Maharaj using present tense. Pallad Maharaj going to use, Pallad Maharaj going to use present tense. Why? It happened long ago? Well, Pallad Maharaj going to claim that I am doing Smaranaka Bhakti. You are speaking Gurudev, but my heart is full of anxiety and tension. So my Smaranaka Bhakti, it is not perfect. You cannot count Properly, you know, it's not perfect. And smaranam kriyate maya. Smaranam kriyate maya, it is present tense. I mean, Prahlad Maharaj, you know, in ch from childhood doing, but still today, Prahlad Maharaj is going to claim that still today, I am trying and trying and trying my, trying my best, but still today, my smaranaka bhakti is not perfect. That's why, Sanatam Goswami, I mean Purlad Maharaj, using this Smaranam Kriyate Maya. Kriyate meaning up to now, still today, I am trying, still today, I am trying to do perfect Smaran, still today, I am trying to do perfect Savarakha Bhakti, but I cannot do. Still today, I am failure. This way, Purlad Maharaj speaking very humbly. And actually, uh, Pallad Maharaj is going to see that Gurudev, you are going to, you know, you are going to speak that Nishingadev appeared for me, appeared for me. He was, he was, you know, he, he was going to, he was going to, you know, lick, he was going to lick my whole body and I'm going to, you know, love me. But it is also, I think it's not scientific. I think your remark, you know, because anyway, Bhagavan always doing different kind of Leela. Anyway, Bhagavan always and every time doing different kind of Leela. And why this kind of Leela? Actually, actually for me, actually for me, Bhagavan coming in the middle, you are speaking, but I cannot, you know, believe that way. Because anyway, Leela my Bhagavan, Bhagavan is full of Leela. So sometime Bhagavan, 
going to appear in this material world for the benefit of his eternal servant joy be joy joy be joy their mistake their aparad was also by the desire of bhagwan bhagwan himself told bhagwan himself told joy be joy has done some aparad unto a little speech of sanakadvisi chatushan by that also bhagwan proclaimed bhagwan proclaimed that it is it was as according to my desire it is not your fault so anyway <coughs> bhagwan going to do some leela time to time time to time bhagwan going to appear and doing some leela for the benefit of whole world infinity world bhagwan doing so how we can say gurudev is uh, going to appear for me he was supposed to appear to deliver it was his a standing commitment to joy be joy joy be joy was waiting and bhagwan appeared and according to the commitment of bhagwan going to deliver these two souls you know so how you can say he was licking me he was loving me but that also is leela not you know i cannot believe that from heart he was doing i don't know you know how we can expect by i am a very fallen soul it is, this is also a mayavadi those who are mayavadi they are they are going to claim that this kind of leela is one kind of maya karya bhagwan going to express some maya but actually you know different kind of mela you know it is a habit bhagwan is bhagwan is habituated bhagwan is always habituated to this kind of leela and there is no speciality with that you know as you can link as you can link this matter with my highness i am not high i am very very small fallen soul what i can do then also prahlad maharaj you know prahlad maharaj speaking it is your highness ho gurudev ho gurudev it is your highness that you are going to take it that way that bhagwan was expressing vatsalya prema to me it is quite natural with bhagwan but you are going to represent the case in such a way i feel sai bhavat dishya mahajan because it is your highness that you are going to think that bhagwan was bound to lick me love me vatsalya prema but i but i think it as a dream but i think it as a dream it was for a very short time bhagwan came and gone now it is like a dream in front of me <coughs> bhagwan appeared and i think it is like a dream and this kind of this kind of exclusive loveful behavior this kind of exclusive loveful affection shown to me by bhagwan you can think it practical but i think it is like dream i cannot believe how bhagwan can love me because i have no quality how is possible bhagwan can love me you know it is quite natural like prahlad maharaj giving this argument that like the fire if fire is on then automatically the reason the reason that fire is there automatically everybody without asking can get heat or light everything follow like any place if there is fire i am not going to expect anything but still if fire is on automatically i can without asking i can get heat heat energy heat energy i can automatically get get heat energy at the same time you know light energy everything i can get follow i can also cook something in the fire is quite natural bhagwan is all the way bhagwan is all the way affectionate Bhagwan is all the way affectionate for all devotees. It's not a speciality for that. You can specifically say that he was saying, "No, there, no, no. I cannot think that way. You know, it's one kind of dream in front of me." And at the same time, bichitro seva dhanam hi hanumat praviti shu eva 
प्रभु प्रसाद भक्ति शु मत सद्भिर न चेतरत फलो वारे से प्रहलाद मा स्पीकिंग इट इज द ओपिनियन प्रहलाद मा स्पीकिंग प्रहलाद मा स्पीकिंग यूजुअल प्रहलाद मा स्पीकिंग इट इज द यूजुअल ओपिनियन ऑफ ग्रेट डिबोटीज दे आर ऑलवेज वॉच दे आर ऑलवेज गोइंग टू वॉच वाट काइंड ऑफ सेवा भगवान गिविंग टू ए डिबोटी अकॉर्डिंग टू दैट इन अ परसेंटेज दे कैन अंडरस्टैंड द कृपा ऑफ द डिबोटी दे कै दे आर थिंकिंग but you are you know going to speak that i am enjoying full kripa of bhagwan how we can believe maybe you are going to cheat me with false appreciation those devotees great devotees they are watching if gurudev love me how it is possible if you watch that gurudev giving me so many seva then you can think gurudev love me otherwise i have no seva how you can say that i am enjoying seva विचित्रो सेवादान ही हनुमत प्रवृति भीषु प्रवृतिषु एव प्रभु प्रसाद भक्तेशु मत सद्भिर्न चेत चेद चेद इतरा चेद चेतरत चेतरत इफ गुरुदेव इफ यू कैन सी that bhagwan giving to give so many seva to me then you could pass this can kind of river all great great sadhu exalted sadhu like you they are usually going to pass remark about hanuman ji maharaj because hanuman ji was maharaj was given countless seva hanuman ji maharaj was given countless seva by bhagwan so vichitra diversified seva so this is the standard on the basis of which you can calculate how much kripa i am enjoying from bhagwan bhagwan going to take bhagwan going to lick my body so going to see affection it is not a standard judgment ho oh, gurudev you know you are going to speak that way i feel sigh for that follow also point is that if at all bhagwan going to love me then why bhagwan going to insist then why bhagwan wanted to insist me <coughs> to get engage in kingdom as a king if at all bhagwan and you know it at all bhagwan love me then how bhagwan can give this kind of tap seva to me to take control over this kingdom is a very you know hard seva you know is a full of problem actually and also it is written bitasur speaking mamo uttama shloka janish saksham videhi bhagwan i like to get i like to i like to get the chance to get the association of your devotees mamo uttama shloka janish saksham videhi i like to get friendship with your devotees life after life mama uttama shloka janish shaksha sansar chakra bhamata in course of my traveling this world 14 world please prabhu please arrange so that i can get the scope to get the association of a pure devotee which is the only solution and bitasur going to speak how we can realize that prabhu going to go how we can realize that prabhu supreme lord going to so keep on me bhagwan himself told many time bhagwan himself told many time actually that jasanu grinami harishe tad dhanam sanoi in front in front of judishir maharaj krishna told if i love somebody if i actually so keep up on somebody then this is a system i always try to take away all opulences all different kind of object of his on the basis of which he can develop false ego i can take away in front of judishir maharaj bhagwan speaking jasya manugrinami jasya ham anugrinami what is written judishir maharaj in front of judishir maharaj bhagwan speaking 
Jashyaham Anugrinyami Harisheta Dhanam Sanai. Like the case you can remember, Tridandi Bhikshu. Tridandi Bhikshu, you can remember from Bhagavatam. Tridandi Bhikshu gave us a very rich man, is a big businessman, Brahman. And by the desire of Bhagavan, all gone. Money, position, rank, all. He was a beggar. He was a, he was a street beggar. He was a street, street beggar. Nothing left with him. Then he took decision that surely, surely, 100%, Bhagavan today is very satisfied with me. That's why Bhagavan is going to take away all object of my false ego from me. So now I am very free to do Hari Bhajan. Tirandi Bhikkhu Seni speaking, going to pass this kind of remark, going to pass this kind of remark that Nunam Bhagavano Tushtaha, Nunam, Nunam and Nishchitam Eva, surely, Nunam, eh, Nishchitam Eva, Bhagavan is today satisfied with me, that's why Bhagavan is going to take away all and everything from me, to make me a beggar, so that I can never express any false ego. Well, I have money, I have educational qualification, I have this, that, I can pass lecture, everybody hearing me, this is false ego. Jashyaham anugrinnami harisheta dhanam sanai Bhagavan speaking, I am going to snatch, I am going to snatch away all property and everything from him, whom I like to show mercy. Otherwise, they cannot look back to me. They cannot understand my dignity. They cannot understand my kipa. Anyway, they will have to. Also, Vittasu speaking, Pungsham kilai kantadhiyam sakanam Jasam padodi bibhumo rasayam Norat jad desh kudvegu adhir Madaha kalir vyasanam sam prayasaha What swinging? Pralatna is going to give the same argument. Very nice, fantastic. You know, Pungsham kiloi kantu Pungsham kiloi kantu dhiyam sakanam Ya sampadu divi bhumo rasayam Norati Jaddesa Udvega Adhir Madaha Kalir Vyasanam Samprayasaha. Bhagavan surely, Bhagavan surely not going to give property and position, everything to a devotee whom he want to, who want to give exclusive kipa. Pungsam Kiloi Kanta. Very nice. If Bhagavan going to give property, position, rank, this surely means Bhagavan is not going to show Kipa. But the case of Prahlad Maharaj and Dhuva Maharaj was exclusive. Dhuva Maharaj never wanted to sit, but Dhuva Maharaj was bound to sit. Bhagavan told, you started your bhajan with the desire to get the seat. I, I give you assurance that you can... No, Bhagavan, sthana vilasin tapadishtitam, you know, follow. Sanabi, I wanted to, I wanted to, I wanted to get the position and rank, but now after searching some, some stone chip and, you know, broken glass, I find Tvam Praptavano Deva, Tvam Praptavano Deva Munindu Gujjam. There is a secrets of the secret. Your lotus feet, your lotus feet is secrets of the secret. Secret of the secrets. So now, by searching some stone chip, some, you know, glass pieces, I discover you. Deva Munindu, Deva Tvam Praptavano, Deva Munindu Guijam, Samin Baram Najachi, Ho Prabhu, Stana Vilasin Tapati Sitam, you know, I know, in the beginning I started like a foolish, in the beginning, like a foolish I started doing bhajan, and with an expectation to get the chair of my, you know. But now, I don't like to. Samin kitartosmi baram na jaji. I am successful. Prabhu, Prabhu, 
Prabhu, oh my Lord, I am successful now. I don't need any position, rag, money, nothing, nothing. But you will have to take. Bhagavan speaking, you will have to take. Because you started your bhajan with the desire. Your, my, your, you know, determination and my determination to fulfill your desire cannot go in vain. <coughs> Cannot go in vain. I cannot allow it to go in vain. Anyway, you don't need. But anyway, your father is going to leave and brother already Uttam Dai, who is going to take control over the you know, kingdom? You have to sit. So the case of Dubha Maharaj and Prahlad Maharaj, Yudhishthir Maharaj, all exclusive. You cannot compare Prithu Maharaj, all exclusive. You cannot compare with in general case. It is not general case. So try to hear. And remember, try to hear and remember this point. Pungsham kiloi kant dhiyam sakanam Yasam pado di vibhumo rasayam Narati jad desh udbeg adhir Vadaha kalir vyasanam sam prayasaha. What speaking? That Supreme Lord, if at all going to bestow kipa on somebody genuinely, is not going to give any property or you know appliances which all are available in the rasayam rasatal you know in this on this art or in heaven whatever property whatever appliances available bhagwan surely not going to give to such a pure devotee you know who is busy with my who is busy with bhakti only narati because this kind of property, this kind of position, this kind of rank can bring tension in the life of devotees. Follow. In the Maharaj is full of tension and anxiety. Pullam Pullam. In the Maharaj is not at all happy, is a full of tension. Narati, Yadesh, because, because there is, if, if you discover, if you discover that I am going to foreign country, I am making thousands of disciples, I am going to collect so much money, then you can start enmity. Otherwise, openly you cannot start enmity. I can give the case, <coughs> I can give one example, which is very nice example. Bhagavan Sikh is now giving this example to Uddha Maharaj. Uddha, <coughs> one day, one very small bird, he discovered one piece of flesh, Mangsha Tukro, one piece of flesh. He discovered that bird going to discover, that bird going to fly to some other solitary place where that bird can enjoy taking this flesh. But in the meantime, all very, very dangerous, like vulture and crow, vulture, crow, all they are running behind that small bird. But the small bird was wondering, he was feeling, wondering, he was wondering, how? Because I have done nothing wrong. I have done nothing wrong. Why they are going to kill me? Finally, the small bird, he was very afraid. And finally, the piece, the piece of flesh fall down from the brick of that small bird. Immediately he discovered, that bird discovered, well, the enmity was not with me. Enmity was not with me because I was meant, I was, you know, going to protect, because I was going to protect my piece of flesh, that's why this problem took place. Otherwise, there cannot be any question of fighting. Follow what I say. So, love, puja, patishtha, whatever patishtha, Bhagavan going to arrange for me, I am somehow going to digest by the desire of Gauranga Mahapu, Nityananda, Somehow, because it is Vaishnavi Pratishta, I have no desire to get any Pratishta. I am in Vyasasan, I promise you. <coughs> so, Bhagavan, you know, <coughs> so, Vittasu speaking, if at all Bhagavan is going to bestow Kipa on somebody genuinely, then surely Bhagavan is not going to give anything from the property, uh, appliances available in heaven or in ras Rasatal, Rasa, you know, or in this world, on this world, what kind of big appliances can be there? 
but still Bhagavan not going to give because Bhagavan know it for sure that if this kind of appliances, if I give to the devotee, devotee can feel disturbance, all problem can happen, enmity can develop, you know, with big anxiety can develop, enmity can, you know, start, and also false ego. False ego can also start. I have nothing. No disciple, nothing, no foreign trip, no money, so they cannot be fighting. Anyway, you are going to avoid me. Ah, useless. Okay, still it is good for me. I have the scope to purify myself by the help of this Harikatha. Where I got this property from Prabhupada Guru Bhargava, that is more than enough for me. I am a very, you know, teeny creature. <coughs> And false ego, you can remember, you can remember the case of Kunti Devi. Kunti Devi going to pray, Kunti Devi, Kunti Devi, Kunti Devi going to pray unto the lotus feet of Bhagavan. Janma Isarja Sutra Sivi Redomana Madha Pamano. Kunti Devi, Kunti Devi speaking. Janma Isarja Sutra Sivi Redomana Madha Pamano. Naiva Arati Avidatum Bai Tamakinchana Gucharam. Oh Prabhu, those who are puffed up because of four factors like taking birth in a high family, <coughs> having educational qualification, educational qualification, etc., or with big riches. <coughs> Shuto Sivi Redhavana Madhava Pumano, Shuto Sri, very good, handsome figure, a beautiful figure. So this can bring, this can bring in the life, in my life. This can bring false ego in my life, so I can fall down. So Kunti Devi speaking, Janmai Sujya Shuto Sivi Redhavana Madhava Pumano, only those who are Niskinchan, Akinchan, they can get the darshan of your lotus feet, they can get Siva, not not those who are not not those who are feeling, you know, you know, false ego due to their taking birth in high family or having big appliances, a very handsome figure, a beautiful figure, or educational qualification. You know, so this is not the, you know, Pungsham Kiloi, Pungsham Kiloi Kanto Dhyam Sakanam, Jasam Padodi Bibhumo Rasayam, Norati Jat, Norati Jat Desh Udbeg Adhir, Madaha Kalir Vyasanam Sam Prayasaha. So you know the argument. Bhagavan giving appliances. Bhagavan allow me to sit in the chair of my father as a king. It is not the symptom of Kripa. On the contrary, it is cheating. Bhagavan wanted to cheat me. And when Nishingadev, because eternally Nishingadev, his Leela is eternally present. So whenever Nishingadev is going to appear in the material world to do some Leela, it is not that for me. Not to best to keep on me. It is usually his doing. You know, this way, Siman Nishinga Leela Cha Madanu Grahoto Nasa Sha Bhakta Devata Raksham Parshadu Dvayo Mochanam Two Parshad Jai Vijay to deliver them and to help all demigods, those who have cried, those who, those who were crying for the you know, for their painful situation developed by Hiran Hiranagasibi Hiran Aksha. They are feeling pain by operation. Follow. So this is usually Nishinga Avatar. It is usually Nishinga Avatar coming and not for me. <coughs> Shiman Nishinga Leela Cha Madanu Grahoto Nasha Sha Bhakto Devata Raksham Parshadat Dayomo Chanam. Ah, this is the reason. And also, 
and also he wanted to fulfill his own commitment. Also, Bhagavan wanted to fulfill his own commitment. He told to Joy Vijay, well, you go within very short short time, I can bring you back. Never, 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 you know, no, don't worry. Eh? I'm going to help him. Brahmo tattaneyadinam kartum bhakyus satatam api nijo bhakti mahatpancho sammak darshaitum param. So many reasons. Purlad Maharaj, out of his humble attitude, going to speak that anywhere Nishingadev appearing <coughs> time to time, not that he is coming from me, and all to best to keep on their eternal two parts of Jai Vijay, also to help those demigods. He was supposed to come anyway. Anyway, and also he wanted to fulfill his own commitment. Brahmo tattanaya dinam kartum bhaka shattata mapi nijo bhakti mahatancho shammak darshi tum param. Well, there is another reason that Bhagavan always, always by different leela, Bhagavan always want to install bhakti among others. Is a is a main purpose. Bhagavan nijo bhakti mahatancha are the dignity of bhakti, the glories of bhakti to is, to establish, install into the heart of common men. Bhagavan coming. And also in tenth canto you can go and Mai Bhakti Hi Bhutanam Amritataya Kalpati. Why you are doing this kind of Onugrahaya Bhutanam Manusim Tanumasitam Ena Karati Tadhisa Kira Jasrutta Tatparo Habit. All this kind of commitment, all this kind of you know documents I in front of you I am bound to uh, express. So Ha Gurudev Brahmo Tatanaya Dinam Kartum Bhak. Bhakshatatam api nijo bhakti mahatancha sammak darshi utam param. He wanted to install, he wanted to establish the glories of bhakti. So he was supposed to come anyway. So Gurudev is speaking, he is having exclusive kipa on me. I cannot find any reason, I cannot find any reason for why, for why you can speak that way. Anyway, maybe you are, you are going to cheat me. You know, by false appreciation. And, Hey Param Akinchan Guru, Hey Gurudev, you have no property. Only the property is Harinam. And Bhaktivinoda Thakur also writing in a Kirtan, eh? Narad Muni has no property. Only the property is Krishna Prema in a Harinam. Narad Muni Bajaya Bina. Radhika Ramono Nami eh? Namo Amani Udito Bhakato Gito Sami eh? Oh ho, so nice Kirtan, Bhakti Muntaku Narod Muni Bajaye Bina Radhika Ramono Nami Very nice Kirtan Paramakinchana Sestro Jadaibo Bhagavan Dadu Rajam Majam Tada Gyatam Tat Kripanus Cha Naumai. The same argument I already told her. Huh? If Bhagavan at all going to think me, think me that I am Akinchan, Niskinchan Bhakta, then why Bhagavan going to give this kind of whole responsibility of this kingdom? Who man care? It's so headache, so much headache. So, <coughs> hey Param Akinjan Niskinjan Gurudev, whenever Bhagavan wanted to give me this kingdom, then and there I could realize Bhagavan has no keep on me. Bhagavan has no keep on me. This is not the symptom of kipa. This is not the symptom of kipa. Gurudev, how you can claim? The moment, the moment, the moment, the moment Bhagavan wanted to give me this kingdom, then and there I could realize Bhagavan never loved me from heart. Parama kinchana sreshto jadaiva bhagavan dadu rajyam mayam 
तदा ज्ञातम तत्कृपाश्च मयि नो नो मयि ऑन मी ऑन मी हे गुरुदेव ऑन मी नो ड्रॉप ऑफ कृपा ऑन मी नो ड्रॉप ऑफ कृपा अब भगवान हॉट एट ऑल सो इफ एट ऑल कृपा इज देयर then why bhagwan going to take travel to give me the kingdom everything which is very dangerous for me especially those property and everything it can it can bring false ego inside me i can fall down they are full of anxiety to run a kingdom mean is full of tension and anxiety because it's rajasik seva so you see parlan was speaking still today i am full of tension and anxiety even today still today i cannot do perfect in a smarana ka bhakti i cannot do today still today so gurudev you are going to speak so many thing again you know about me because bhagwan himself told in front of yudhishthir maharaj all so many documents there in shastra that when i am going to give kripa to somebody first of all i like to snatch i like to take away all properties belongings all belongings that he has because because those items those appliances and everything can be a reason for why some false ego can develop inside my heart so it is not the sense tvam bhangsayam tvam bhangsayami sampad bho jasso banchami anugraham साक्षीण स्तो एन व्याहार महता अभी दिस् कैंड ऑफ स्पीच दिस् कैंड ऑफ इनो कमिटमेंट बाय भगवान ऑलरेडी देयर इन शास्त्र बाय वन स्पीकिंग इफ आई एम गोइंग टू शो एक्चुअल की पा तो संबरी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू गिव अप्लायसेस मानी पजिशन एवरीथिंग नॉट बिकॉज you know i like to so actual keep on them but people out of their ignorance always want to get false ego patishtha everything reason what i can do this way pallad maharaj want to pallad this way pallad maharaj always this way this way this way pallad maharaj always want to pass away this way always pallad maharaj want to pass away the kind of you know dignity the kind of you know appreciation done by gurudev he don't like to accept it and pollad ma speaking hey gurudev hey gurudev you try to think over and again gurudev you see the my situation gurudev you try to see my situation now what is my condition bhagwan give me kingdom so i am i am going to waste my time with the minister and all you know servants everything they are wasting my time i am going to waste my time with you know with this you know those you know those servants i am going to waste my time with the ministers <coughs> i am going to waste my time gurudev i feel very very sorry for that because in troubleful in this kind of troubleful situation i am going to lose all my bhajan in this kind of troubleful situation in in this kind of troubleful situation anyway i am going to lose my bhajan now i am left with no bhajan because always i am busy with talking with my friends and you know you know servants and with ministers everything previously i was uh, trying to do some bhajan at present all bhajan gone all my bhajan gone i am busy with material work like talking and you know, a passing judgment you know because of the justice you know so many tra- tra- problem coming i am going to hear everything all material talkings and going to pass remark to give gives one punish to give punishment to somebody or to make him free from punishment this all responsibility coming this all different kind of responsibility coming to contaminate my life gurudev 
पश्चमे राज्यो संबंधाद बंधु भृत्वादि संगत सर्व तद भजनम लीनम धीक धीक मांग जन्नो रोदम रोदिमी आई एम फीलिंग साई हो हो गुरुदेव आई शुड क्राई आई शुड क्राई आई शुड क्राई बट आई एम नॉट क्राई दिस माई पेनफुल सिचुएशन फाई धीक धीक धिक्का आई एम गोइंग टू यू नो गाइंग टू आई एम गोइंग टू हेट माई सेल्फ दैट आई कैन नॉट डू भजन प्रॉपरली हो गुरुदेव ट्राई टू थिंक ओवर एग माई सिचुएशन यू नो पशो मे राज्यो संबंधा बंधु भृत्वादि संगत सर्वोत हो तत्जनम लीनम लीनम धीक धीक मग जन्नो रोदिमी आई एम नॉट क्राइंग आई एम नॉट क्राइंग दैट इज अंटम दैट इज अ प्रूफ एविडेंस दैट आई एम नॉट डूइंग भजन इफ आई हैव अट ऑल एन यू लव फॉर यू इफ आई एम गोइंग टू लूज यूर भजन देन वाई नॉट आई एम गोइंग टू क्राई आई एम नॉट क्राई फॉलो दिस वे ऑल माई भजन फिनिश ऑल माई भजन फिनिश ऑल गॉन एनी वे Well, if I am say, if I am anyway, if I am sitting in a chair, I mean throne, every all public coming. Sometime all all my friends and you know relatives they are coming to meet me, talk with me. All with material talkings, I'm to, I'm going to lose my time. This is my painful situation. <clears throat> also, Mahaprabhu wanted to pass. Mahaprabhu also Mahaprabhu wanted to. Also, Mahaprabhu wanted to pass remark. Also, Mahaprabhu wanted to pass remark about father and uncle of Raghunath Das Gosai. Mahaprabhu not speaking. Mahaprabhu never speaking. Well, they are giving donation, big donation, so they are great Vishnu. Never speaking like that. Mahaprabhu never speaking like that. On the contrary, Mahaprabhu speaking. That your Raghunath, your father and uncle, they are actually materialistic personality. They are no trace of bhajan, you know. You know. Anyway, a devotee, a devotee. Anyway, one devotee. <coughs> Anyway, one devotee, if Bhagwan going to ask you take some property, my influence or everything, a uh, devotee never less interested to take. Follow never, because they know that material thing, that material thing, material relationship, material things, going to make me blind. So. You know, <clears throat> Prahlad Maha speaking. A pure devotee never like to accept all different kind of property and everything. Nothing because they know it very sure that his property can make me blind, and I can go on doing such as such a things, which can become a more tight bondage for me, which can create a more and more tight bondage for me. So anyway, they never like to take anything. Of course, by the desire of Bhagwan, sometimes some devotee accept him. But Judishin Maharaj speaking, all this property, all this raj, rasuya jog, rasuya jogyo, you know, Judishin Maharaj speaking, Ho Prabhu, Ho Krishna, all this rasuya jogyo, I'm you are doing arranging. I am going to enjoy the full sober, full soberjunity. I am going to enjoy the full sovereignty all over the world, but still, I think it is nothing for me. Only your love, your bhakti, you know, unto your lotus feet is a property. It's nothing else. You know, follow this way. So, also to Uddha, Bhagwan told how you can develop bhakti bhav. 
you know, if one man is hypnotized, if one, if if if, if anyone is is hypnotized, if anyone is hypnotized by material property, then what use? He can miss his position. He can lose his consciousness and fall down. You can remember long long ago I was speaking. Why somebody asking me why? Lakshmi Devi, the goddess of riches, going to climb owl, owl, which is very cheap. Why? <laughs> Why at all Lakshmi Devi going to ride or owl? Where is the she is she is the god she is the goddess of riches. Well, the reason well the reason is that whenever Lakshmi Devi is going to give property to somebody, then at the same time they become blind. They become blind. They cannot understand who is Vishnu, who is not Vishnu. They want to ignore Guru Vishnu. They speak all rubbish. That is called the symptom of false ego. Be it in the case of one Maharaj, Acharya, anybody, is a is the symptom of false ego. So anyway, Bhagwan actually, you know, I give answer. That whenever Lakshmi Devi is going to going to uh, show kripa on you, you can get billions of dollar everything. There is one kind of poison for you because this appliances can make you blind. You cannot you cannot realize you cannot understand the dignity of pure Vishnu. You can think I am a pure man. They are poor devotee. Eh, go kisu baba useless. They have no property, no position. In the whole world, I have position, rank. I am doing so much brick preacher preaching all over the world. All you know, they are useless. They have done nothing. A pure devotee never they, ne, a, pure, a pure devotee never think that way. A pure devotee thinking, a pure devotee always saying, I have done nothing. I am useless. I have done nothing. So <clears throat> I am going to lose my time because I need to give some time for relatives and friends. They are coming to meet me. Or most of the time I am giving to ministers. They are discussing so many topics. Or oh, this way I am going to lose my bhajan. And also in the Puran. In Puran I can discuss this point tomorrow. Today not possible. Bhagavan purposely Bhagavan purposely wanted to fight with Prahlad Maharaj. Prahlad Maharaj, with, with Prahlad Maharaj, Bhagavan purposely wanted to fight with Prahlad Maharaj. <laughs> Prahlad Maharaj was going towards Naimi Sharana. Prahlad Maharaj went, was going towards Naimi Sharana. And that time, Bhagavan appeared in front of him. A, as a very, very, you know, bad personality, like a, you know, ferocious personality. Because Pulladma discovered that the man in front of me, he has some, ta you know, he has some matted here, matted, matted here. At the same time, he is going to catch Kamandul, everything. At the same time, he is going to carry bow and arrow. He is just opposite. If a man is ferocious, he can take, he can take, you know, bow and arrow. If he is at all sannyasi, he is Bhagavad Bhakta, why he is, why he is going to take, you know, and this kind of, you know, opposite, you know, symptom. We see. He is a matted here, he is in tapasi. It is clear that they are doing, he is doing Australian pronounces. At the same time, going to carry bow and arrow, it is not fitting. I must give answer to that man, his, you know, his false ego. He is going to have a matted here, doing tapasa. At the same time, going to carry bow and arrow. I cannot tolerate. Then started fighting. In the way of Naimi Sarana, Prahlad Maharaj started fighting with that, that sannyasi. We are having matted here, everything. But Prahlad Maharaj, by the mercy of Jogomaya, but but by the mercy of Jogomaya, but by the mercy of Jogomaya, Prahlad Maharaj could not realize he is Vishnu Supreme Lord. 
He couldn't realize. Next day, Pallad Maharaj was somehow, somehow uh, could not fight properly. Next day again, that he could meet that man that day, that you know, whenever Pallad Maharaj is going to face, whenever Pallad Maharaj is going to face this cruel personality, ex externally, cruel personality, then he discover, ju then Pallad Maharaj is going to discover, just this morning, I was worshipping Bhagavan and giving gar garland to him. The same garland I find in the neck, neck of the sannyasi. I mean, the cruel man, maybe he is my Supreme Lord. He paid prostrated downward under the foot of lotus feet of that, you know, that sannyasi. And he could realize, well, he is my Supreme Lord. He is my Supreme Lord, he could realize. That the incident happened, happened, you can find in, in Puran, you know. <coughs> Oh, somewhere it is written, in other Puran it is written, Naimi Sharana, and somewhere it is written, Bhag you know, Prahlad Maharaj going to Badrika Asram. Badrika Asram. In different Puran, different, different things. <coughs> somewhere it is written, Naimi Sharana, maybe in both places we can say. So, Naimi Sharana, and somewhere it is written, Badrika Asram. In the way of Badrika Asram, in the way of Bhardhika Asram, he started fighting one of Swanyasi, who is going to exhibit just opposite, you know, thing. What you are, you know, Sanyasi, he should be very, you know, humble, he should be, you know, there should not be any jealousy, yesterday. but what is this, just opposite. They started fighting, this way, Prahlad Maharaj going to express, Prahlad Maharaj going to express strong grief, this way, this way, this way, Prahlad Maharaj is going to express strong grief that if at all I have bhakti and at all Bhagavan, you know, have full kipa on me, then how it was possible, then, 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 then how it was possible for me to fight with Bhagavan? Then how it was possible for me to fight? I mean, there is no kipa on me. Annatha kim visalayam prabhuna pisrutena me punar jati sabhavam tvang prapta seva rano bhavet. How it was possible? How it was possible for me to fight with Bhagavan? If at all I am enjoying Kripa, not possible. Actually, Prahlad Maharaj now speaking, Atma Tattva Padeshe Shu. Because Prahlad Maharaj speaking, Prahlad Maharaj is going to defend himself. <coughs> Prahlad Maharaj wants to pass away this kind of, you know, honor and position his Gurudev giving. He is speaking, Ho oh Gurudev. He was speaking that Due to my association, you are speaking, Hey Gurudev, you are speaking, Hey Gurudev, you are speaking, it is, you are speaking, Gurudev, that it is by my association, many, 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 you know, Asura buyers, they were successful to change their mood. Follow. But actually, I am taking birth in Asura family. I am taking birth in Asura family. Actually, Tattogyan properly, no proper Tattogyan is there with me. Atma Tattopadeh Vishaya Asura Kula. Because though I am taking birth in Asura Kula. So those who Asura, they are Rajasik. Anyway, I am taking birth in Asura Kula. So naturally, I have no, you know, conception about perfect Siddhanta Vishaya. Perfect Tattva Siddhanta. But whereas you are saying, that it is due to it is due to my association, those so-called you know, those you know, boys of Asura, they were successful to change their mood. But I I think not. I think I think not. 
आत्मो तत्वोपदेश दुष्पंडित्व मया सुर संज्ञा न अद्यापि मे शुष्को ज्ञानांशो अपोगत अधमा आई एम ए फॉलन सोल एंड आई हैव द स्कोप टू मिक्स विथ द असुरा आई एम सेंग इन सुथल ना ऑल द टाइम आई एम मिसिंग आई एम टॉकिंग विद देम असुरा सो हाउ यू कैन एक्सपेक्ट गुरुदेव आई हैव प्रॉपर यू नो तत्व ज्ञान तत्व ज्ञान इज टू बी फ्रैंक टू बी फ्रैंक गुरुदेव टू बी फ्रैंक तत्व ज्ञान इज वेरी रेयर फॉर असुरास तत्व ज्ञान इज रियली वेरी वेरी रेयर फॉर दोज असुरास दे कैन नॉट ग्रैप्स दे कैन नॉट अंडरस्टैंड तत्व ज्ञान एंड by the association of those asura boys by the association of asura <coughs> because i have taken birth in asura kula asura destiny so whole day and night i am busy with asura i i have dealings i have dealings i have dealings and behavior i have dealings and behavior with those asura anyway all the time i am busy with them so uh uh the dry a uh, some portion some portion of dry some dry portion of gan <coughs> some dry portion of gan uh, maybe you have seen but that dry portion of gan is still there i cannot get pure bhakti because dry gan is just against pure bhakti so anyway still today dry dry gan is going to put me in trouble anyway still today still today anyway still today dry gan going to put me in trouble i am going to i am going to grow dry bairagya dry gan which has nothing to do with pure bhakti follow follow what i say because i am mixing i have all the time i have dealings like rup sanatan speaking like rup sanatan speaking to mahaprabhu prabhu we are always we were busy with we are we were always busy with asa sangha mlecha sangha mlecho prabhu we are fallen we have no dignity nothing we lose everything all our spiritual treasure all nothing there prabhu nichu nichu jati we are we are taking birth in a low caste and all the time we were busy with asa sangha mlecho mlecho sangha so prabhu we delivered sanatan and rup sanatan gosai and rup gosai sanatan gosai and rup gosai crying and paying dandava to mahaprabhu and praying for and paying begging for kripa with 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 a straw with a straw holding on the thread in the mouth I'm going to pray prabhu whole life we are doing asa sangha we are doing bad sangha prabhu we are actually taken by the low caste low family at the same asa sangha going to buddha is trouble how we can do bhakti impossible like sanatan roop pallad mara also speaking my dealings and behavior always going on with asuras so prabhu ho oh, gurudev how we can expect i can get bhakti impossible annathak acha yes atmo tatto upadeshesu he was speaking that i was the i was the preacher of tatva gyan in front of asur balakas but not that don't take it that way gurudev atmo tatto upadeshesu दुष्पंडित्व मया सुर संज्ञात न अद्यापि मे शुष्को ज्ञानांशो अपगत अधम आई एम ए फॉल एन सोल द ड्राई पोर्शन द ड्राई पोर्शन ऑफ माई इन अ ज्ञान ज्ञान ड्राई ज्ञान स्टिल टूडे गोइंग टू पुट मी इन ट्रावल इज नॉट स्टिल टूडे इज गोइंग टू कॉन्टामिनेट माई हार्ट सो हाउ यू से गुरुदेव i am actually as the advisor of tatva gyan to asura balaks because i myself asura i taken birth and for asuras tatva gyan is most rare thing they are rajasik i am also asura 
And you cannot speak that way. O oh, Gurudev, Atmo Tattva Padeshesu Duspan Dittu Maya Surai Sangyatna Adapi Me Shusko Gyanam Sho Apugatu Adho Maha. Follow what I say. So try to understand up to this point. Next, tomorrow I can start discussing so much point by all your blessing. I can try my best. So I like to stop here today. Pungsham kiloi kanto dhiyam sakanam jasam padodi vibhumo rasayam norati jat desh udveg adhir madaha kalir vyasanam sam prayasaha vanchagalpatru sikipasindhi vyavcha patitanam pavana bhavishna bhyo namunam.